Hey man, shout out to Drink Champs for that interview with Irv Gotti. But y'all remember when Irv Gotti did that interview with Drink Champs and then he started talking about Ashanti and Nelly and his relationship with Ashanti and how in love he was with her and how she broke his heart and all that. <laughs> that man was hurt. I, hey, he might he might be somewhere punching air and kicking clouds right now because the he, the news now is that Ashanti is now pregnant with Nelly's baby. God, good Lord. But can I tell you what? There's a lot of people that was wishing for this a long time ago. Even I was one of the people that was saying, come on now, Nelly, it's time to like buckle up. You know what I mean? I don't know what you were doing before, but we ain't getting no younger, baby. Let's just get married. But they still not married, though. They just pregnant. So Nelly and Ashanti are all the buzz following a report from US Weekly that the singer and actress is pregnant with the rapper's child. I'm taking this one from Yahoo.com. All right. Reached by Yahoo Entertainment, a representative for Ashanti had no comments and a rep for Nelly did not immediately respond either. So the reports followed one from TMZ, which said that while appearing at Nelly's 11th black and white ball for charity in his hometown of St. Louis, Nelly does this every year. And this was the 11th one. So, you know, he's committed to that. So it's been 11 years since he's been doing this, putting on for his city and it's all for charity for his city. She showed up at one of them balls. He and Ashanti both posed for photos with their hands on their bellies as part of a possible inside joke. The couple has a long history together. And, you know, with years as a couple, maybe more than we realize because they've kept us all guessing about exactly when they were a couple and how long they've been a couple and when they were actually together versus when they weren't together anymore and all that. We wasn't keeping up with these people's business. We just thought Nelly Ashanti, Ashanti Nelly, and that's it, right? All right. Here's a timeline that was revealed online about their relationship to get you a little bit of understanding. First of all, let me say Nelly just sold a part of his catalog of his music and came up with hundreds of millions of dollars. So he is financially, financially, financially secured, right? Now, Ashanti just got back all her publishing rights and stuff to her music, and she's now remixing, twisting, fixing everything the way she wants it so she can get out there, too, and get the bag that she deserved. They both got their money. They both got fame. They both got everything they set out to get in life, so it's the perfect timing. Now, when the house is right, bring the baby in. She revealed on an episode of VH1. This is from 2003. Let's start from the top. In 2003, she revealed on an episode on VH1 Behind the Music that she met her future love at the 2003 Grammy Awards announcement event and a photograph of them was snapped and that photograph went viral. The first time I met Nelly, he asked me for my autograph, but I think he was being sarcastic and I remember writing it down on a, on a program. She told the show, right, that picture has been in so many publications as something else but it all started out as a joke for the record it took him a long time to even get my number we just snapped the picture together everybody thought we were together then the artist showed up together at a bash for p diddy new fragrance it's a pretty big deal because she has said that Though they have gone on a date at this point, they weren't boyfriend and girlfriends. Roll over to December 13th of 2009. We went from 2003 to 2009. Ashanti co-star in Nelly's sexy video for Body On Me. The two, they got flirty on screen. And then there were signs that they were dating. Like when she denied that they were dating but says that they plan to get engaged sometime in the future but for the most part they're still keeping their personal lives quiet right now december 14th of 2010 nelly clarifies their relationship with ashanti and says that he's not ready for marriage Uh uh-uh the the rapper revealed in an interview at the time with wrap up tv that he and ashanti they're just taking things slow you know getting the feel each other out and love on each other a little bit and take time right now we're just friends 
I'm married to my work, he says. I'm married to getting things in a certain situation right now, and she's married to getting things in a certain situation right now. He says that marriage is something he takes very seriously. He's not with the, oh, I'm married to you, and two years down the road, you're talking about, oh, I'm not happy anymore, so let's file a divorce. Marriage is for life, so I'm not jumping in and out of it, right? What people don't understand is that I think you really have to be like friends, friends first. That's the thing, he says. It's not about how long it takes to get married. There's no time limit on this. I'm not a person who wants to be married more than once. I'm not a person who wants to be in a relationship more than once. You're dying if you leave me, is what he says. So he takes it that serious. God damn. March 5th, 2014. Ashanti says she has no beef with Nelly. Amid breakup rumors, Ashanti gives an especially candid statement about Nelly's status with her. This is when they might have been going through some stuff and we saw it in the media. Where? Well, damn, they're not together no more. How come we don't see them together anymore in pictures and whatnot? Publications doing projects together, whatever. It's a very small industry, she said. This is her talking back then. She said it's a very small industry. Are we going to see each other? Yeah, I'm not bitter though. She said in an interview at the time with radio station Hot 97. I feel like in a relationship, it's like ping pong. Sometimes you love them, sometimes you hate them. That's a real statement. Everyone goes through that, is what she said. That was 2014. 2015, March 13, 2015, a month later, Ashanti confirmed that her and Nelly had broken up. Now, this broke a lot of people's heart because they're like, man, we believe in y'all. We know y'all are going to make it. Two stars, young, vibrant, successful, all this other stuff, both good looking. That baby is going to be the bomb. And then, you know, people follow celebrities and try to like mimic celebrities. Oh, that's couples goals. Right. They were that back then. During an appearance on the Meredith Vieira show, the host says to... You aren't together anymore, and you said it basically came down to trust, and I think that is something that so many women deal with. How do you handle trust in relationships? Why do you think it's hard to trust somebody? That's what the host said, and Ashanti replied and said, I think sometimes people have their own insecurities, and it allows them to act out of character. I've been betrayed, and I just feel like, again... You just have to grow. You have to grow up. You have to accept responsibilities for the things that you do. You know, I'm not a big fan of being cowards. Fast forward from that to September 15th of 2021. Nelly and Ashanti reunite at Versus. Remember, we were going through the pandemic. You had Swiss and uh, what's his name over there? No disrespect to him. They had the Swiss, they, they had the versus battles going. It was dope, right? Ja Rule and Fat Joe versus battle features a cameo by the two, Ashanti and Nelly. Although neither of them had known that what was going to happen, he came over to hug her on stage during their group performance. Now, look, this is that crazy part. I had no idea he was going to be there. Somebody set this up, right? This is what everybody was saying after because Fat Joe did an interview after and it seemed like somebody set it up, but they're in the industry and they're friends with them. So they know what's going on behind the scenes. We don't. We just fans on the outside. She said, I had no idea he was even going to be there. She tells Ja Rule afterwards on Instagram live. I haven't seen him or spoken to him since we broke up. And that was like six years ago or something. So I didn't know what to expect. And he appeared surprised too that I was there. I seen his eyes get big and I didn't know what was going to happen. She says, I didn't know what to expect, but it was positive, right? And this is when everybody, including Fat Joe and all of them was like, yo, Sparks was flying, my boy. Sparks was flying. I think she was somebody. Nope. You with somebody. Nope. Okay. Well, y'all better go ahead and put that together because that's what the world want to see. And I think that's what y'all want to do, too. We seen it. Right. Fast forward to December 2022. 
Ashanti and Nelly are in a better place. On December 4th, the pair performed together again. This time, they do Body On Me at the Arizona radio station's holiday concert. Then, on December 14th, Ashanti tells Andy Cohen on his Watch What Happens Live show that she was shocked at the positive fans' response to her reunion with Nelly. I don't know why Ashanti was shocked, because she should have known from day one. Everybody wanted them to be together. My reaction was, wow, she says. It was a lot of comments and a lot of people that was wanting that. What I will say is we're in a better place. They had been fighting, but we're cool now. Ashanti says, yeah, we have some conversations, you know, so it's cool. June 9th of 2023, Nelly and Ashanti are back on a red carpet together. The two have a date night at a glam event in Atlanta. Their appearance marks their first on the red carpet since 2012. Sheesh. And then September 12th of 2023, Nelly and Ashanti confirmed that they're officially reunited as a couple. He does it first during an appearance on Fellow's Boss Move with Rashida. When asked if they were back together, he says, yeah, we cool again. I think it surprised both of us. It wasn't anything that was like, I don't think I planned. I think we both were pretty much doing what we do. But sometimes being separate, you understand one another more. That evening on a red carpet at the 2023 MTV VMA, Ashanti tells E! News that the pair have reunited. The singer is asked about it because she carries a clutch with a photo of both of them at the event 20 years earlier. She thought the accessory might be cute. And of course, it was. October 13th. 2023, Nelly pays tribute to Ashanti for her birthday, surprises her with a necklace. Such a beautiful and incredible person inside and out, he wrote, as part of a sweet note under a collection of photos that captured the two together. The post makes it clear that fans had inferred for months, especially from this post in August, of them singing Usher's nice and slow song together. November 4th, 2023 Ashanti gives birthday love and a car to Nelly a car now while they keep their relationships mostly private Ashanti just like Nelly they was very open about their feelings for him in a caption of four videos and photos of them together they showed her presenting him with the gifts a beautiful car one of the kindest most genuine men I've ever met she wrote you have such a big heart and you're always giving to others. Today is your day. I love you. Happy birthday. Right? And the caption in the, on social media, she put, Happy birthday, big head. One of the kindest, genuine men I've ever met. Uh, you have such a big heart and you're always giving to others. Today is your day. Love you. Happy birthday. Well, November 2nd, you know, I'll be a little late. November 2nd, you know, I be a little late. We had a lot going on. And then there was a crying, laughing emoji at Nelly. And then there was a birthday celebration emoji. Big shout out to hashtag Just Call Ronnie. Thanks for helping me find the best gift ever. Camera clip at New North Well at J Productions 360 Booth, so on and so forth. And the final one is December 4th of 2023. U.S. Weekly reports that Ashanti is pregnant with the couple's first child together. This could be the reunited couple first child together, it said. He's already a father to four other children who are now adults. So Nelly is like in granddaddy stage. He a, he a young granddaddy. Still good looking young granddaddy, but he's in granddaddy stage. Old enough to have adult children who could have had children of their own, including two 
from a previous relationship and a niece and a nephew that he adopted, right? So their mother, the niece and the nephew that he adopted, that was his sister. And his sister's name was Jackie. And she died of leukemia in 2005. And Nelly, being the honorable brother he is, he adopted his sister's children and raised them along with his own two children. So they call him a father of four. But in reality, he is really a father of two. But if you ask him, it's no different from having his own, from his own blood. So that's a father of four, right? Ashanti knows all this behind the scenes. I didn't know all this till I started doing this story. More shout out to him, man. First of all, for the charitable works that he has done for St. Louis for, oh, 11 years straight. And then that's that's a commitment within itself. You know, you got a lot of money. You want to fly to prom, places around the world, do things, be selfish, buy yourself nice things. To be committed to something for 11 years and counting, that says a lot. And it's strictly for the city. It's strictly for the underprivileged. And then to be honorable enough to take your sister's children, legally adopt them, and raise them as your own after she passes away. Man, I've seen a lot of people, siblings pass away, and their children go to the wayside. Daddy ain't here to protect them no more. Um, mama ain't here to protect them no more. And the children just got to raise themselves or they get abused and bounce from home to home and house and in the system and out the system and over the grandma house and grandma too old and can't take care of them. So, again, we know the dynamics of what could happen there. That's just me shouting out Nelly for being a good person on the Nelly and Ashanti tip, though. I've been waiting for this to happen. I don't know. How about you? Were you waiting for this to happen as well? Do you think it's a good look? I know somebody is going to say. Yeah, she pregnant, but they're not married. They just got engaged. Well, check it out. Nelly said it already. He is not running into no marriage because marriage doesn't have a time limit on it when you get it done, when you start it. The fact is, you have to be really good friends in this lifetime. And then once you have your bestie, then you marry your bestie and it'll last for the rest of your lifetime. Right. A lot of people jump into marriage for the feeling that they felt at the moment. And then when that feeling fizzles, they go running for the divorce hills. So I have all respect for that as well. At the end of the day, they're both responsible adults. Obviously, they both also are financially secured, obviously, so they can more than take care of this new baby that they have coming into the world. If indeed there is a new baby coming into the world, leave your comments in the comment section below. I'll catch you on the next video. It's BrainFlow TV. I'm out. Peace.